Hi there, it's Peter Tomlin from Skew Food, and we're reviewing our 2024 trends and trying to give people in the food and beverage industry some information and things to think about about where to focus resources in your business. And our fourth trend is to really understand whether you're delivering value within your category. And a lot has changed. We know we've been through huge periods of out of stocks three or four years ago, and then we've gone through a period of food inflation, and a lot of categories have had shifts. We've had products change packaging sizes. We've had retail changes. We've had people change promotion strategies. So you really need to spend time looking at your category, understanding the products you compete against, and whether the consumer still has a compelling reason to buy your products. Is that value proposition that you are talking about that you are delivering on still enough to get people to pick up your product and put it into the shopping cart. And a lot of times we talk about value, I think people jump to the conclusion of being lowest price. And I don't think that's really the right way to look at it. I would encourage you to look at value as the combination between quality, all the attributes that your product delivers, and the price. And if you have some things built into your product that deliver more than other ones, then the retail price can be higher because it uh, it delivers more for them. But you need to make sure that you're communicating that and that you're still communicating that given how the category might have evolved since the last time you took a good look at it. So go into the store, look at your product relative to all the others. We would suggest you do a category review and you look at everything that you're competing against, understand how you stack up, and then figure out are we on track or do we need to change some things because it's it's probably tougher than it has ever been and maybe you need to relook at your promo strategy relative to what other people are doing in the category maybe you're spending too little maybe you're spending too much but it's always a good time to to take a look at that and explore that value proposition and make sure that you are delivering value within your category